Hey y'all, Pat Kelly here of Mad River Outfitters. Welcome back. Today we're gonna to be doing a product review of the Solares fly tying resins. Uh, pretty cool company. They've actually been in the UV uh, resin game longer than anybody. They've been around since the 1980s. Uh, and they've gotten their start uh, kind of making <clears throat> UV cured resins for surfboards and marine repair. Um, but they've been doing uh, a lot of fishing type epoxies for quite a long time. So it, it's not necessarily new, but has been getting a lot of press lately in the last couple of years. We just recently brought it into the shop and really been digging it. So it, it's pretty awesome stuff. Comes in four different, uh, you know, viscosities, if you will. There is a bone dry, uh, there's a thin, a thick, and then also a flex, uh, which is really, really awesome. So we'll just kind of dive right into it. The, uh, this is the bone dry here. It comes in a little half ounce bottle. It also has a little applicator brush on it, which is really cool. It makes it really easy to work with. As far as the viscosity goes on the bone dry, it's probably equivalent to, uh, you know, maybe a water-based head cement. So it's, it's, it's pretty thin. It does a really good job anytime you need uh, a resin to, to penetrate down into thread wraps or penetrate down into a material. Um, this is your stuff really 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 thin which is awesome also dries super quick um, you know in my experience working with this stuff I mean if you have one of the higher end lights you can cure this stuff in about two or three seconds at the most um, so also no tack whatsoever I mean you can put this on anything uh, it seems like with just about any decent uh, UV light you're not going to experience any tack with the bone dry uh, or any of the products for that matter it's it's pretty incredible um, so really awesome stuff half ounce <clears throat> this bottle here I've been working on this for probably a couple of months and then I've maybe only used half of it so it doesn't seem like a lot of uh, a product but it does go a really long way next one is going to be the thin which comes in the blue bottle we carry it in the two ounce size here in the shop <clears throat> this is probably you know what I would call uh, ideally you want to have all of them if you can but if you're gonna have just one or if you're just gonna buy one to kind of start out with and, and mess around with the thin is probably the best all around you know you can kind of do the most things with the thin it's gonna be obviously a little bit thicker than the bone dry it does have some substance to it you know if you if you you can build up some heads you can do wing cases uh, you know shell backs things like that um, it's got just enough body to it that you can kind of build up heads if you need to you got to work with it a little bit quicker because it will start to run on you um, but it's got just enough body to it that uh, you can kind of use it in a, in a wider range of applications uh, really really good stuff also tack free uh, and just incredibly strong I mean it is just uh, it's amazing how, how strong all these products products are uh, we're gonna do a little smash test Stop. Have uh, we're going to do a little smash test with a hammer uh, later so you can kind of see what they're capable of. Uh, that's that's one of the things I've probably been most impressed with with all of these is they're just bomb proof. They hold up really, really well. Uh, next thing, or the next uh, next one in the lineup is going to be the, uh, the thick, which comes in the pink bottle. This stuff uh, is just that. This has uh, got a lot of body to it. What I like about the thick is anytime you're building up bigger heads, uh, epoxy heads, or if you're doing surf candies, you know, anything that you need to build up a lot of body really quick, this is the stuff. Um, wherever you may apply it, it does not run really quick, so you have a lot of time to kind of play with your materials, get things where you want them, mess around with them. You know, it doesn't run, um, doesn't really go anywhere in a hurry, which is really nice, so it gives you plenty of time to kind of fuss around with it, get it the way you like it. Um, and again, just bomb proof. You know, anytime you're doing bigger epoxy heads on musky flies or, or uh, you know, any of your saltwater patterns, um, this is this is kind of your go-to. Also, just just bulletproof. I mean, it, it, I don't think I've had any flies crack, fall apart. Uh, I haven't had anything delaminate yet at all with any of these products. Um, one thing that the Solaris does too. Is it done yellow, which is nice. You know, that's been one issue with some of the UV resins out there. Uh, over time, they tend to yellow um, with age, but uh, so far, no yellowing whatsoever. Um, the next one in the lineup is probably by far my favorite, just because we've kind of been lacking uh, flex cured resin uh, for a while. Um, this one's in the green bottle, also two, two ounce bottle. 
Um, this stuff is awesome. I mean, it is just incredible. Uh, <clears throat> a lot of different applications. You'll see me use this in a video that we're releasing uh, here in the near future. It's a kind of a polar fiber game changer. Um, anytime you're doing bait fish heads or if you're you know, building a header along a br you know, with a brush, a brush style head, um, this stuff is great. You can kind of just paint it on, you know, whether it's crapper or a bait fish brush or anything like that. This stuff is really, really awesome. Still very durable, remains super flexible. Um, one thing that kind of surprised me with some of the flexible resins out there is they tend to, uh, because they're flexible, they tend to delaminate off of materials, I find. Uh, this stuff just stays put. So it, whatever you put it on, it tends to do really, really well. I use this stuff a lot. I mean, the red, I just, the flex, uh, that's by far my favorite. It's, it's awesome, awesome stuff. All right, so now we're gonna do just a real quick, um, I'm gonna just gonna put a dot on this little fancy display here of cardboard. Um, and then we're just gonna put a dot on each one. I'm gonna hold it up, let it run down. Um, so get out your notebooks. There's a lot of science here taking place, so just bear with me. We have bone dry over here, thin, thick, and then flex here. So I'm gonna hold them up. You can kind of see them running. That bone dry is just really off for the races. Look at it go. Then you have the thin next to that, and you have your thick, and then your flex. So pretty cool. Hopefully that uh, shows you everything you need. We're gonna jump into a uh, quick little hammer test also. All right, guys, now we're gonna do a quick hammer test for you. I'm gonna just put a dab of each one here on this uh, paper. I'm, we're gonna cure all of them and then I'm gonna go through and just start whaling on them with a hammer to see how they hold up for you. All right, now I'm gonna go through, cure each one, and then start uh, hammering away. All right, hammer time. All right, first one's gonna be the flex. Well, I got it to stick to the hammer, but no breakage thus far. Yeah, perfectly intact. All right, next is gonna be the thick. What the f is going on in here? Keep it down, I'm trying to run a business out here. All right, here's the thin. Yeah, should probably turn your volume down now that we're halfway through. Pretty ridiculous, <laughs> actually. Was able to cut through it there with the screwdriver. All right, so that one did crack <clears throat> after a couple of hits with the hammer. The thin and the bone dry are not delaminating though. The uh, the thick and the flex kind of popped off, but the uh, the thin formula and the bone dry are still stuck pretty good to the uh, to the paper here. All right. Well, there you have it. That's uh, you be the judge. Pretty impressive stuff. <clears throat> if you have any questions about any of these products, uh, feel free to give us a call at the shop. Shoot us an email. Happy to answer your questions as always. And thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.